Now to the stunning arrest in a Southland cold case. Real estate heir Robert Durst was captured in New Orleans and faces extradition. He's suspected of killing a West L.A. woman nearly 15 years ago. CBS 2's Brittany Hopper has the latest on the investigation. Brittany. And Juan, an interesting and bizarre twist tonight. After HBO aired its finale on the documentary series called The Jinx, which may be the reason investigators made an arrest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kill them all. That's the voice of Robert Durst, unaware his mic was still on while filming for HBO's six-part documentary series, The Jinx, investigating the history of Durst, a real estate heir who is suspected of murdering three people. He was arrested Saturday night in New Orleans. I think this is it. This is the final straw for Robert Durst. Durst's attorney told the Associated Press that his client's arrest was all about Hollywood. In last week's episode, it exposed a letter which appeared to have helped crack a cold case of his one-time close friend and confidant, Susan Berman of Beverly Hills. In 2000, Berman was found shot to death in her Beverly Hills home. Berman's former co-worker spoke out Sunday night about Durst's recent arrest and also remembering Berman as a gifted woman. To finally see that, you know, perhaps it was a college friend, perhaps she did know something he didn't want anybody to know, and that's why he either had her killed or he may have committed the crime himself. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of sad when you think about it. Years ago, Durst admitted killing his neighbor in Texas, but was found not guilty in that case, saying it was self-defense. Questions have also been raised about whether Durst was involved in his former wife's disappearance in 1982. Durst comes from a very wealthy family in New York who have said they believe he is guilty of these crimes. Now, Durst is being held without bail. He's expected to be in court Monday morning. Live in the newsroom, Brittany Hopper, CBS 2 News.